Hey guys, it's Michelle, and today's video is going to be yet another five weird concepts video. You guys really like these videos, and honestly, I do them somewhat often because I have a lot of weird concepts, but I did it today, honestly, because I didn't feel like doing conspiracy theory research because it's Christmas and I'm a procrastinator. <laughs> also, I just love filming these videos. They're some of my favorites to film because um, I just like tripping out and it's fun and like they're just fun because it's like my thoughts and I'm just talking to you guys rather than like, I don't know. The first weird concept that I want to talk about is drugs. So, <laughs> drugs are so fucking weird dude. Like you can like hit a blunt and then like just be tripping like you know what i mean like you just be like high and like stuff or if you like do some acid like i'm not saying do drugs like don't um do that but like if you do like you take this supplement this drug and your whole world just fucking goes nuts like that's so crazy if you think about it like literally what I think that's so weird. I literally think about drugs all the time that like you're just tripping out because you took like a substance like What the fuck? I mean, I guess it's a similar thing with alcohol except for alcohol I feel like you don't see colors and like do all crazy shit it just kind of like makes you a little fucked up but like Drugs like hard drugs like acid like literally you're just you're tripping balls because you like took a pill or took a Thing. I don't do drugs. I'm a good kid. Um, so but if you do drugs like I was gonna say why, that's cool Why are you making, I was, I was why are you making yeah. a disclaimer if you do drugs? I know I was gonna say that's cool, just, but like um, don't do drugs. Like, Next weird concept is curse words What is a curse word? And why is it bad? Why is saying fuck bad? Why is saying cunt bad? Why are these bad words? Like what defines a bad word? Like who made it up and was like that's that's a curse word, like, I mean, if you watch my videos for, like, around four seconds, you know I curse a shit ton. And honestly, because I feel like I don't get why you're offended by fucking words. Like, it's literally a word, bitch. Fucking deal with that shit. Like, get over it, man. Like, I don't know. Like, I just, I'll never understand. Like, I will just, I'll never get it. I'll never, I'll never get it. The next two, like, weird concepts kind of have to do with death. So if death trips you out as much as it trips me out, um, fucking sorry, but, like, you're about to trip balls. Okay, so the first thing that weirds me out is, like, you can't, like, I mean, this one's not really about death, but, like, kind of just about, like, living in general, like, just the unknown of, like, living. You can't ever know what people are actually doing unless you're, like, with them. So say, like, think about your friends and think about what they're doing right now. Like, you can't, like, you'll never know what they're doing exactly in this moment. Like, if I'm thinking of my friend Angela, like, I don't know why she just came to mind. But think about Angela right now. I have no fucking clue what she's doing. She texts me that she's watching Lizzie McGuire movie with her dad. But like, I don't know if she's scratching her head right now or like, I was gonna say penis, but like she doesn't have one of those. So I know she's not doing that. Like you literally just never fucking know exactly what someone's doing, like unless you're with them. Like you can never physically know. Like what if they cease to exist? I always think about this. Like what if you entire, like your entire life, your friends and everyone is like a figment of your imagination and you don't, and they're like just not doing real things like they just stop living like when they're not with you and that freaks me the fuck out And like you just don't know like you just can't see what they're doing like is that not freaky as fuck like that's so weird Next weird concept is about um Dying like what if you're dead already like right now and you just are don't know like I always think of this Like what if when you die you don't think that you die and you're just your life continues, but like in an alternate kind of reality, like that's like your life continues in your head how you think it does. So like say like when a family member dies or a famous person or whoever, someone you know dies. Um, what if for them, they're not dead and they're just living life continuously throughout their head, who, how they think that their life would have pl panned out, but like they're actually dead. Do you ever think of that? And not only that, but what if like you are just keep getting reborn? Like what if there's no heaven, no reincarnation, but like kind of reincarnation, like you get reborn, but like as yourself and you just keep living your own life over and over and over again, but you like never realize. I don't know, I wouldn't mind that that much though. You know what I mean? 
but it sucks for people who have like really shitty lives and like I feel bad but it's kind of crazy. The last weird concept that I want to talk about is tattoos. So if you guys look at me, you know I have a few tattoos visible, aka these cute little hearts that I'm obsessed with. And I've got this one. I've got a few tattoos up my sleeve. <laughs> Literally. But if you think about it, I mean, this probably can be explained letting you know. But like, where the fuck, like how the fuck do we do tattoos? Where did they come from originally? Like who invented them? And why is it like when you use a specific ink, like why don't, if you write in a pen, like it doesn't stay on your arm forever. But if you like drill a hole, like theoretically when you get a tattoo, if you don't know, you're taking ink and like a needle and you're dragging it through your skin. But like why does it stay there forever? But like it still fades kind of? I don't know. And that's another thing is people be like, oh tattoos are forever, but like they're kind of not. Like nothing is forever except for death. Like, that fucking freaks me out. Unless it's, like, um, unless you die, unless you, like, die and reincarnate. But basically, if, like, the reincarnation doesn't exist, nothing is forever. People that say things are forever, nothing's forever. Nothing is forever. Nothing's guaranteed permanent. Nothing's permanent but death. And that fucking terrifies me. Like, to think about it. Like, nothing is. Like, anything you think is permanent really isn't, except for death. Your name's not permanent. You could change it. Your, your tattoos are impermanent, you can get them removed. Like, it freaks me the fuck out. Nothing is permanent in life besides death. That's so weird. That is it for all these weird concepts. If you guys liked this video, please give it a big thumbs up. Let me know in the comments your weird concepts and if you like these videos, because I mean a lot of you guys say that you like them. I don't know. What are your favorite videos that I make? I'd like to know. Make sure you follow me on Twitter, Snapchat, and Instagram because you guys always tweet me and Snapchat me your Instagram uh, direct message me weird concepts and that's super dope because sometimes I steal your ideas. <laughs> I'm just kidding. But like, yeah, sometimes I get inspiration from you guys. If you want to check out my latest video, click right here and you can click right here to subscribe for new videos every single day and I will see you all tomorrow. Bye.